Hey, it's Lisa DeBoer and Scott, and we're here at EMS Expo Live for your Gimme Five on Friday. And we have asked Jonathan Merrill one more time to show us what you've been working on, how are things are going with the Butterfly BVM. Just real quick, this is a demo that we've been doing while, this is the first time we've yes. done this demo at this show. Um, we, we asked people to say, I know this is a, you guys are peds centric, but I'll, right. I'll start with an adult yeah, focused uh, demo. So. I this was why I wanted to do this. Give me five because this is fantastic. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You so, spent a ton of money on this device. Yes, what is this? This is an IMT Analytics uh, test lung and analyzer. They use this to calibrate um, uh, ventilators yes. professionally, like in hospitals. So it's a highly accurate uh, machine. And uh, we, we tell people like, hey, how many times have you seen you? Know, they're going on a run. They're resuscitating a petite adult female, right? Yeah. And somebody goes like this. Right. Yeah, oh, 100%. Right. That's exactly what they our do. Our tidal volume there is 973 milliliters, wow. right? Huge amount of air, and there's nothing that stops me from nope, doing that. No, that's exactly, that's, yep. Right. And if you go more, okay, what's the yeah, max you just, you just got? You just did over over a liter. You just did one liter and 30, 36, uh, 36 <laughs> mils. So with the Butterfly BVM, you would go on a run, and you would instead, you would set this on, let's say, small adult. I'd probably keep my pip on 40, all right? And then I would squeeze here. All right, what did All right, you get? we just delivered 361 mils. And okay. the, the biggest, is... which if you look here, 361 mils is right in that four to eight ml per kg range for that patient. And nice. what's cool, we tell people like the biggest, burliest guy on your on your ambulance gonna grab that is not, is not gonna, gonna be able, be able to, to go more. much higher than that. Now, if you need more volume, you can go up on your volume. You can also go up on your PIP, right? So if I set this all the way up on max, right? I can get, right, 670, to 700 mLs, which is right where you would need to be for a large adult. But again, peds focus, if you wanted to go, let's say down for a, a nine-year-old, right? Then let me set my pit back at 40, okay? 231, right in that range for where you'd wanna be for that that child. And again, this goes all the way down to a, to an infant size as well. And every single, I see you have all the masks there. All of the masks work with this. Correct. We, we in our yeah, in our I, lab, the, we did we were playing. Uh, yeah. We were playing with. Peep. You can add peep to this. So it's a standard peep valve. Nothing. Yeah, standard peep valve. Don't need anything fancy. Oxygen tubing goes in here. And the reservoir that. was interesting because you said yes. that's built in. Yeah. Now. The the, uh, the oxygen reservoir is, is we call it internal, so it's in here. So because this opens more slowly. We don't need to have the reservoir hanging off of the back right. here. Um, the last thing I was going to show you is just um, this is the this data. Is our published data. So and, that, and this is available. Did this one? Yeah. This elsewhere. is available on our website. But really quick, we had uh, emergency medicine docs resuscitating an adult mannequin and a pediatric mannequin with the butterfly or Ambu Spur two and the butterfly BVM. The average breath with Ambu was was outside of range. You see the air bars there. That's what we already know. If we're all passing around the same Ambu bag, we're gonna give different volumes. Sure. With the Butterfly BVM, the volumes were right where they needed to be. Uh, tight air bars, meaning you're getting consistency across the crew. And the, the coolest thing about this, in our cohort here, they had over five years of being trained and retrained and retrained on Ambu. Five years of being like, hey guys, don't hyperventilate, don't go too big. Yeah. And we gave them a 30 second introduction to the Butterfly BVM before they had to use it and mm -hmm. they nailed it. So That's pretty cool. Fantastic. That's all I want to say. That, and that was one of the reasons that we wanted to do this because so often we know mm -hmm. that when we have a really critical child that we are, 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 are stressed, we're, we're there and we're overventilating these kids. And in our class, one of the things that just begging way too fast and way too hard. Way too fast, way too hard. And that's why we were very excited when you started working on this invention that this is something that's a game changer potentially for kids. And I love that you have this device. Again, yeah. what was that called that you were able to really accurately? This is a Citrix H4 from IMT Analytics. Great oh. little piece of equipment. That's fantastic that you're able to get really solid data about what yep. what the bags yep. are doing. So and thank you for, testing. and this is, what is this? This is their test lung. It's and one the of the smart So you can adjust compliance, resistance, yeah. you can change all those settings on it. It's fantastic. Yep. Well, congrats on the amazing invention. Please soon. All right. Well, thank you for all you're doing to help kids. We right, appreciate so much, you. Thank you. And we'll see you for another Gimme 5 on Friday. And we're signing out from EMS World Expo 2024 on Friday the 13th, one of Scott's favorite days. Beautiful thing. <laughs> all right. We'll see you. Bye-bye.